Hey guys, what's going on? This is the Sidechammer channel. Today I'm going to go ahead and destroy an old VCR and DVD player. This thing has been with me for so long, probably more than seven years. I've had it for so long, I don't even know how to use it. And frankly, I haven't used it since I've gotten it, probably the first year. It's so ancient, so old. I don't even know if it works. It probably does work. I just never really tested it out. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna go ahead and smash it with my six pound sledgehammer. I did plan actually to buy an ax for this video, but I think that's gonna be for my next video. I didn't quite have the uh, time or resources to buy an ax for, for this one, but next video or maybe the video after that, I'm probably gonna buy an ax just as an extra. Uh, and I think that would be a really cool addition to my videos. So let's go ahead and smash in this thing and see what kind of destruction we can get. So this one actually has a metal chassis and the front here is plastic. So this is kind of similar to the receiver I destroyed in my last video. And that was a very hard receiver to destroy because it had a full metal chassis and I couldn't penetrate it at all or get into the internals because it was so powerful just how it was built. Basically, I was just bending it. So this one also has a metal chassis, probably not as strong as the receiver, but hopefully we can penetrate this one and actually cause a lot more destruction than the last one. So I'm gonna hit it from the top and from the sides, from pretty much every angle and see what kind of, what kind of destruction we can get. Let's get started. Wow, that was loud. Let's keep on hitting it. Yeah, this one also has that metal chassis. Very hard to penetrate. All it's doing is bending. I'm gonna go ahead and try to put it on the side and see if I can get a better angle. Ooh, it's a, it's got a, like a strong, very firm uh, feel there. All right, here it is. Here's the aftermath. I hit it from the top. You can see the nice marking of the actual sledgehammer on top. That's pretty cool. I'll zoom in here a little bit. So I'm gonna keep hitting this thing. I'm gonna keep smashing on it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do a non-stop, uh, a montage thing. I'm just, not, I'm not gonna stop. No, no breaks. I'm just gonna keep hitting it until it breaks and um, see if we can actually penetrate it. Wow, that bottom is tough. I mean, that bottom is bending a lot less than the front. Check this out. So at least I can see the front. That's, that's getting really destroyed. All right, let's continue on. Wow. Oh man, <laughs> that is just getting absolutely demolished. Oh man, I don't even know how to get through this thing. I'm gonna turn it around side and to the back and see if we can just, con just continue hitting it from the back. See if we can get those, um, those bolts out of there somehow. Yes sir. Yep. Man, I'm hitting this thing hard. Like, I am putting all my force into this. Maybe I need a heavier sledgehammer. Maybe my six pound sledgehammer is just no match for these metal chassis.
Okay guys, I have been hammering on this thing for quite a while now. I don't know how to get through this thing. All I got was this plastic piece right here. I got through this, but man, look at that. That is insane. I mashed up all the internals, but the external skeleton here, the chassis, is just not budging. It is built to last, guys. This thing is insane. Look at that. The fan right there. The backside is really the toughest metal part because I was hammering on this thing. As you can see, it really does not compare to the top. The bottom half is just just really tough. Whatever metal they use here is really not really really tough. So I think the DVD receiver won this time. I feel like I cannot smash through it, but I only have a six pound sledgehammer. So I do plan on buying heavier sledgehammers in the future for these types of tasks. And that's actually why I wanted to buy an ax too, just so I can cut through this. But couldn't really do that this video, but thank you guys anyways for watching this video. Go ahead and like, subscribe, and as always, in the comments below, let me know what I can destroy next. And God bless guys.